All right, so I'm here today to talk to you about this piece of video equipment. Now, this is the MPT 1100 SS from Servo City. You know, I saw Servo City release this a couple weeks ago, and I reached out to them to see if they would send me a demo unit for a video review. As you can see, they have. I've had about a week to try it out, and uh, I'd like to show you how it works. So, are you ready to get started, Bogues? Great. Okay, so what is this? This is a motorized pan and tilt head system. You can see that it moves on the X and Y axis, and it can rotate a full 360 degrees in both directions on the X and Y axis. Now you may own or be looking for a nice fluid head like this Manfrotto 504 HD, which I bought a few weeks ago for $370. The Manfrotto head is one of the best that you can buy. It's very smooth, but it's still a manual movement. Occasionally, you can still get some sudden movements or jerkiness. The system comes with four parts. The first two parts are the CAT6 cable and a power cable. The CAT6 cable plugs into the head and runs to the controller. The power cable runs from an outlet to a controller. A battery supply can be used and is specified on the Servo City website. Next, the remote control. This is a joystick style controller with everything you expect. It can move in any direction, including up, down, left, right, including diagonal. Furthermore, there are two dials here that will allow you to control the speed of each access. If you wanted to turn one access up or down, variable speed, you do it like this. On the back, there is a mounting uh, clip for a jib mount, which is awesome so that you can mount it to your crane or jib and uh, be able to control it at the same time that you move it uh, up or down. On the back side, you can see these controls. You have your power input over here as well as your motor. Uh, this is where the CAT6 cable control goes over here. There's a fuse as well in case something goes wrong, and an on and off switch right here. Now onto the head itself. The head can either be moved horizontally like this, or vertically like this. It can move 360 degrees in either direction. Right now, it's set up straight up and down. It can also be flipped over and mounted upside down, which would provide for some pretty interesting shots. In addition, it can be mounted on a tripod, like this one here, which is the 536 Manfrotto with a bull, or it can be mounted on a jib um, with the optional jib accessory kit. Now, let's take a look at some sample shots of how this looks in action. I started to think of what else I could use this for. You know, it's got such great movement, both on the X and Y axis, as I said. And I started to think, well, can I use it as a turntable, uh, since it has a 360 degree radius on the X axis? A lot of video and photography people might have a need for this. So here's the footage of when I tried that. Overall, I think this is a great alternate buy to a good quality fluid video head. Not only do you have the option to move on the X and Y axis, with a motorized head, but you can also move diagonal with a great fluid movement. In addition, you can move 360 degrees in each direction, which is fantastic. 
Well, I hope you enjoyed this video on the MPT 1100SS from Servo City. If you enjoyed this video, I hope you share it with your friends. If you have any questions on this video or ideas for future videos, please reach out to me at www.mnwebco.com or find me on Facebook or Twitter. And thanks again for watching.